our first knowledge video of 2018. Today we want to talk a little or make a little comparison between uh, 3D printing and electroforming. Electroforming is quite an old technology already. It's done by Vico already for, for, more, than 80, uh, for more than 80 years. 3D printing, it's, it's quite new. It's uh, evolving very fast. It's, it's quite popular, especially about, uh, under the young engineers and not without reason. Um, 3D printing is mainly used for rapid prototyping, uh, complex shapes like gearboxes, but uh, not yet in high volumes. That's maybe the main difference with electroforming. Electroforming, uh, also possible in 3D, for example, uh, bellows, uh, cylinders for textile printing, optical lenses, they can be made in three-dimensional shape. But at FICO, we mainly uh, produce manufacture uh, electroform precision parts in two-dimensional shape, uh, flat shapes like shaver foils, inkjet nozzles, uh, or, uh, encoder discs, or whatever. Sometimes we call it 2.5D, but then we are combining layers, for example, for an inkjet nozzle plate, where we combine the inkjet chamber together with the, with the nozzle plate, calling it 2.5D. Uh, with 3D uh, printing, more and more uh, materials become available and even polymers are possible. That's not possible with electroforming. With electroforming, there are some restrictions on the type of materials that can be used. Uh, most of the materials, most of the time, is made in nickel, nickel, cobalt, uh, palladium, palladium, nickel, gold, these type of materials, but not uh, possible in, in polymers. Uh, 3D printing is done layer by layer or droplet by droplet. Uh, electroforming is done atom by atom and therefore electroforming is much more accurate uh, with tolerances down to one micron where 3D printing still is in the field of let's say 10-20 micron uh, tolerances. I look at 3D printing as a complementary technology over, over electroforming technology. I don't think it will be a threat due to the mass production that we already achieved and the very uh, accurate tolerances uh, that we can achieve. But there will be some very exciting uh, developments in, in the near future. Please, if you want to know more about additive manufacturing, then please visit our site, uh, ficoprecision.com. Mm -hmm.